Hey guys, Joe Pye here at Advanced Innovations in Austin, Texas. Welcome back to the shop. You know, I think one thing that we can all agree on is uh, as we do jobs, setup time is going to be a hassle and it's going to be quite a variety of uh, requirements. Well, this piece right here is about 18 inches long and I need to drill and tap holes in the end. So I figured I would share with you my setup. As soon as I get the light squared away here, we'll show you exactly what I got. There you go. This is one by two, 6061 aluminum, bolted from the ends to form this particular F shape, inverted F shape. Now the reason it looks like this is because for quick setups, I squeeze this part in the vise, and this back guy here. I guess let's go around the back and take a look at it. it. has holes. So as the vise bites on this piece, it slides over the back jaw and secures here as well. Projecting out, and the drop bar allows for stops to be set, pins to be added. And there's a pin here for some of my longer pieces. That is a very handy little thing to have. It allows you to also mill certain angle features on your part by use of just tilting this however you want to tilt it. So I strap it to the table at times and at other times I hold it in the vise. In the vise is really quick. Swing the head. The head is swinging about just what, 45 degrees give or take. Yeah, 47 degrees and it is telescoped, telescoped projected slid forward so I can access the workpiece. Quick, dirty little setup for you. Hope that gives you some ideas to get past some of the obstacles in your shop. One other thing I have got to say. I got a, something in the mail yesterday. I think it's probably one of the coolest things I've gotten in a long time. And thank you to everybody that sends me oil cups. I've gotten quite a few in the mail. But this one is a little different. I haven't seen this before. This was obviously a Coors Light uh, Big Mouth aluminum bottle. Section the bottle off, take the top, turn the top over, stick it back down and hem it absolutely love it very cool idea i'm sure any beverage in an aluminum bottle would do so thank you very much for that that was a great surprise hope this setup works for you guys this is what i call my tall part outrigger build yourself one you'll be glad you did let's take a look at the optional setup for this thing like I said, it's a quick connect. Just stick it right in the vise. Use the backside mounting threaded holes for the other jaw. And there you go. Quick, accurate, solid as a rock. And you can put just about any outrigger on there you want. I've got a variety of tapped holes, countersunk holes for whatever projection I'm looking for for whatever job I'm doing at the time. Hope that you like it. This has served me well over the years, and uh, if you don't have one and you have the stock, go ahead and make one. Thank you very much for watching. This was a quickie. Joe Pye here at Advanced Innovations in Austin, Texas. I'm out.